The following segment is sponsored by Eater Mountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. Welcome back. We're talking today about the importance of newborn screenings and how it pertains to congenital heart disease. We have Amy Nance here. She is the program manager of the Utah Birth Defect Network. And uh, there are, what, three screenings that newborns go through. Let's uh, start with number one. There are. So the critical congenital heart screening, which we're going to talk about. There's also the hearing screening and then the blood spot screening or the heel stick. Okay, so, uh, and that's them right there. So with the pulse screening, what do they do? Just, I guess, take the pulse and see if it's... So it's, it's like what you would get when you go to the doctor's office and they put the probe on your finger. Mm -hmm. Basically, that's the same thing. So it's a non-invasive, not painless screen. Um, but for a baby, they put it on their hand and then either foot. Right. Probes. Uh, congenital heart disease, a CCHD. Correct. And how, how do they uh, pinpoint that if there is a problem? So we look at the levels of oxygen, which is what the probe is doing. Okay. The sensor is measuring the level of oxygen in the blood. And then we use those numbers um, to determine if there is a reason to look further. Um, because if, uh, if the baby were to not pass the screening, um, they would call the pediatrician or the healthcare provider to evaluate that baby and then an additional screen of perhaps a echocardiogram would be ordered mm -hmm. to follow up and really look at the heart. Now, is this state law? Do all babies go through those three tests? It that, is. It whether is. they're born in a hospital or? Correct. Um, so it is state mandated. So again, whether you're born in a hospital, a birthing center, or at home, your um, health care provider should be providing these um, screenings um, for you in the hospital birthing center or the, your midwife at home. Right. So uh, where can folks go to get more information on this? So help.utah.gov backslash um, CCHD and we would love to talk to you before your pregnancy or the nursing staff can answer questions at the hospital. Just so you're ready for that and you know Correct. what's going on. Yes. All right. Well, thanks very much. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate you coming in today. All right. Mary?